hello YouTube welcome back to my video uh, in this video I am going to show you a simple Java program uh, which can connect to MySQL database and do some basic operations here we go so this is my Eclipse IDE I am going to create a Java project here so right click uh, new and uh, project I'm going to search for Java project and click next I'm going to give the name and as uh, uh, connect MySQL okay and I'm just uh, finishing it let all this be default just click yes and wait for some time to get finished yes I have created uh, my Java project at, as uh, connect MySQL so inside this you can see uh, the default JRE system libraries which are coming uh, automatically and uh, now I'm going to create a, a package here com dot dot com now I have to add uh, mysql jar in my JRE system library you can see mysql jar is not there mysql jar is the file which is helping our java to connect to mysql database mysql database is a third party database so we should add uh, uh, the java for that so for that just go to properties and you will get the java build path and here we can add add external jars and i'm going to add mysql uh, connector java 5 beta bin dot jar this this one uh, can find uh, the description below to download this and uh, I'm just adding that and press OK. Yes, I have added my reference library MySQL connector jar file. Now I'm going to create a class here. The name of the class I am uh, giving it as DB connection. In all uh, the project, first create a class and named as DB connection. Let it be static. I mean, don't do anything uh, on that because uh, it will be helpful in uh, our project uh, if there is any database change you, ha you have to just update the information in this uh, class only now let's uh, code for the connection uh, things here so inside this I am writing a function uh, public uh, I'm writing as void get connection okay now it should not be void it should return a connection class and just press control space uh, it should be from java dot the yeah, sql okay okay i have uh, imported the connection uh, class now we have to code further uh, to get the connection details so i'm giving a, an object of that connection 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 equals uh, null and I'm just returning a that same uh, connection object here now between these we have to add uh, the connection information of our MySQL database so first one first index is uh, class dot uh, for name and uh, inside the string we have to give uh, the URL of our JDBC so it's uh, com dot mysql dot uh, JDBC dot driver and yes uh, it's uh, giving it might give exception so uh, I'm putting this in a try catch uh, I guess so the exception would be catch in uh, catch in the catch section now let me copy this inside to the try catch block and uh, here let I'm just giving an uh, just to print I am uh, giving system dot out dot print the exception which I have caught now uh, just make the connection to the driver class information so connection equals driver manager dot get connection now we have to give uh, the mysql database name with the url and uh, the username and password of mysql 
so the URL uh, will be jdbc colon mysql slash slash localhost slash uh, we are connecting to test database so I'm giving it as uh, now before that uh, we have to give the uh, port number so it's uh, colon 3306 slash test this is this is the database test is the database which we are going to connect now I am giving the username and password of my database as uh, root and password is root okay now we are all ready to test uh, our database connection and for that I am uh, just giving a main method inside this uh, DB connection so this is only for testing you know you don't want to put this in your live production environment so I'm just giving a main method now I'm just calling a DB connection object and uh, now uh, just creating a connection uh, object here again connection connection equals and uh, ob connection equals the class name dot uh, get connection okay now i am just giving a system dot out dot print just to print uh, the value so if, if the connection is successful it will uh, print a value and if the connection is failed uh, it will print null now let me run this as a, a java application you can see it is null so our information is wrong here let me see yes uh, the driver should be capital letter so if, if i'm running again again some issue yes it has uh, given uh, i have forgot to add a colon here again let me run this yes now the connection is successful now with this db connection i will show you a small example of uh, some basic stuff uh, to get a value from get the uh, values from a table so let me go to my mysql table okay now i have uh, a table a database named test which uh, we have connected using this link and inside this i have a table named categories and have data all these data now we are going to write a program to get all these data printed in my console now for that i am creating a class here uh, it's giving as dao as the name so inside that i am giving a method public void check data so inside that I am going to give a try catch because uh, the connection class we are going to use so it may throw some error now we print the exception now here I am writing a small query string query equals select star from uh, what is the name of table name of the table is categories okay now I am getting the connection uh, object connection object here for that I am just getting the connection object and the creating the object here now a connection object this is the uh, db connection and i am getting a connection object here actually connection object is equal to uh, dot get connection now this will return a connection to this connection uh, object now we are I'm going to use prepared statement I'll you uh, I'm not using uh, just use prepare statement because uh, it is very good compared to other ones so prepare statement uh, ps equal to null now I'm I'm writing a code this one connection equal to no uh, prepps equal to connection dot prepared statement prepare statement 
put the SQL query here now I'm using a result set to get all the values result set it's from just queue result set not uh, queue result set r is equal to uh, ps dot execute query now if uh, now it's a uh, while rs dot next if uh, the value is there as dot next so inside there I am just printing the values system dot out dot uh, category plus uh, rs dot get string I can give either uh, one or uh, SL number or one or two to get the uh, column number one and column number two. I am going to give the uh, column name actually. So better to use column name. So it is easy to use always and I define the code what is there. Now we are ready to test uh, the basic thing. I am giving a main, main method here and uh, creating an object of uh, that clause. I'm just calling this method here check data now if I'm running this it should see all the data is there yes all the categories which is uh, taken from uh, this table is shown in my console so I have shown you the basic uh, connection class a Java program to connect to the database and a simple program to take all the values from the database and if you have any doubt in this please comment below I'll be helping you and I'll share the source code in my description and uh, thanks for watching and please like and subscribe for my videos.